Okay, step number three. View and delete selected comments or track changes. Change the display for a view. View to all markup. Okay, read the comment at the top of the document and then delete the comment. Okay, I'm not going to read it, but um, select the comment, press delete. Right click on it and press delete. Find the first track change in the document. Left, right, and top margin change. And reject format change. So I right click and then click on that. I viewed the changes in the document and then accept all changes. Okay, step number four. Apply the title style to the title on the first page. Okay. Apply the heading one style to all the bold headings. Okay, I think that's it. Apply the heading to style to all the underlined headings. Okay, step number five, insert footnotes and apply text formatting. So let's go to the first page. Oh, quick format painter to make that go off. Double click to bring up the footer. On the first page, insert a footnote for weekly schedules in the schedule your time section. Okay. Type weekly schedules on a available on your counselor in the follow book store. Okay. Now we also want to <coughs> insert a footnote at the end of be sure the scheduled time for all of these in your 119 hours right there after the period the time be sure to 
schedule factory time in the one hundred and nineteen hours. Okay. Step number seven, insert placeholders in the body of the document in the introduction section. On the first page, insert a new placeholder name Navo. I know I'm butchering that at the end of the body paragraph before the period. Test anxiety. Okay, test anxiety section on the second page, the end of the body of the paragraph, and before the period. So click here, and we'll click uh, sort of citation, and then Sierra here. Okay. In the goal setting section, on the fourth page, at the end of the intro paragraph, Okay, step number eight, use the source manager dialog box to update placeholder reference information. Open the source manager. Okay. Click the show all biography field box if necessary. Okay, type a source book, Arthur T E S A C B A R O. Title, study skills, and college students, years 2018, city of Chicago, publisher is McGraw here. Okay. Edit the Sierra placeholder to include the following information. Type a source. Document from website. Corporate author. The Sierra Pacific Community College District. Name of web page. Tips for student success. Name of website. SPCCD.edu year 2019 month February Feb RY 
a in the URL. Actually, I'm going to change this to 2020. In the URL is HTTP www.spccd.edu tips for success PDF. Okay. Close. Step number nine, change biography style. Insert a works cited page. Change the biography style to MLA. Place your insertion point on the blank line at the end of the document. Insert a page break. Okay. Insert a works cited page. All right. Let's get rid of these extra lines at the end. Just gotta go. There's the works cited page. Step number ten: Insert a table of contents. Place your insertion point at the beginning of the document. Insert a page break. Type student success tips on the first line of the new page before the page break and press enter. blank line below student success tips insert the automatic table one table of contents automatic table one okay apply the title style to success student success tips Okay. Step number 11, insert a footer and add custom content. Edit the footer on the first page. Document which has the table of contents. Check the different odd and even pages box. The different odd even pages box. Insert the ascent bar two from the page number current position drop down list. Position accent bar two. Okay, press tab two times. And insert the document title, document information, document title. 
go to the even page footer here and insert the accent accent bar two from the page number current position accent bar two. Okay, press tab twice. Insert the company. Okay. Change the font size to 10 point and apply bold formatting to all footer containing both of the even and odd footers. So grab all of this. Changing it to 10 point and bold, and the same thing over here. Bold, 10 point, and then close the footer header section. So there we go. Step number 12. Insert and customize a cover page. And then we want the slice light like so. Delete the subtitle, document subtitle. that course document fields change the font size of the title and the cover page to 40 point Okay, since 40 isn't listed, we'll have to type it in manually, like so, and apply bold. Okay, step 13, insert a page break before the physical signs of text test anxiety. Okay, update the entire table of contents. Okay, save.